example, like maybe your company sometimes uh, have partner dinner with uh, uh, with your first year customer or some uh, awards night for all the AIA agent or stuff like that. So we do end to end planning for events for corporate functions or social events like uh, maybe some of you getting married we do wedding dinner rom ceremony or maybe your baby full moon party birthday party so we uh, as i said we do a to z end to end so from fabrication like backdrop and um woodwork woodwork uh construction a uh, backdrop booth build up we do that uh, every equipment supply like uh sound and light uh camera uh, LED panel and creative design like all the flyers we do printing also brochure bunting and then uh, for event when the talent required we also do source for that we have a full list of uh, data pool that we have been working together closely for for the past years like MC singer uh, or back-end videographer photographer and gift like we Malaysian like gift every event we give out free gift so we source for the right gift for the right event with uh, the appropriate budget. Okay, so oh, so most of you get to know from Instagram. Okay, then we will we will push our next next workshop from Instagram then. All right, so now let's get started. Okay, uh, so uh, do later on we will yeah uh yeah sorry before I forget uh we will actually mute you guys first uh.
Wendy, are you done with uh, sorting your flowers? Um, yes, I I think. Oh, it's okay. just not blowing quite strongly, so my flowers are like flying away. <laughs> Which one is your favorite flower? Which flower do you like the most? Uh, I actually like lilies, but over here, I think I think I think I like this one the most. I, I don't know what's this called. That it's is like, that that is. Yeah. You know, are, are there any meaning for this flower? Like this is one this? is like just a um, like a filler flower, so it doesn't really have a ah. very special meaning, unlike the you know roses and other stuff. And then baby's breath. Okay, la, roughly, roughly. Okay. The leaves, the confetti, that is okay. And then you see all these small, small flakes. You don't throw them first. <laughs> because actually they are small, but they are very, very useful. So don't throw any away first. Yeah, basically, don't throw anything. Uh. Yeah. Any, everything that we give you uh, can useful. be used. <laughs> you guys got your scissors already? Scissors. Uh, so now we can, while waiting for iron, we can open up our frame first. So, because we need to take out this uh, plastic out first. Uh, for Wendy, maybe you can remove your picture first. I gave you another extra because that one, the color wasn't very good. So you can either keep it or do anything you want. <laughs> the one in the frame <laughs> is the final. Okay, so, cool. Yeah. Okay, so now we take out this plastic first. But the the protective film, uh, you can remove later. Like now we just take out first. And then after take out the plastic, and then you put everything back. For I now we are uh, taking out the plastic of the frame. Yeah, we are taking out the plastic of the frame. And then after take out, put it aside and then uh, we will put it back together again. So you take out the black black part and then we take yeah. out inside. And then we take out this piece of plastic. So it is uh, it is empty. And then we put back the white frame, right? Yeah. yeah. Just take everything out first. So Ayin, which style do you like? Do you like the text to be... Uh, like this in the frame, or do you want to try pairing the names? Like a DIY style? Which style do you prefer? <laughs> uh, I, I oh, sorry, I can't hear you now. I, 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 uh. I can't see your video. It, it switches back and forth from yours to Wendy's video. Uh, no, uh, Rina is asking which style do you like? Do you like the entire text to be inside the frame or you would like to like cut out DIY and then stick alphabet by alphabet, words by words? Uh, yeah. I think uh, uh, the, the whole text in the frame is fine. Okay, oh, okay. Very cool. So now after we put everything back, so here is empty. Yeah, you can put, put the frame back first. Yeah, the sometimes the metal you need to uh, push harder, lah. Yeah, push harder. Okay, maybe I too 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 soft. And then you make it stand on the table. Later we'll do it this way. Then you just directly stick it here. There's no glass here, right? Uh we take no, out the glass first, and then after we finish, only we put it. Okay. So put back the white frame. Put back the white thing, and then put back the black black. Uh, cover and then close it back yeah. and then we make it stand on the table right yeah so we can right. put flower good okay all right so uh just one rule later when you stick the flowers make sure it doesn't ex exit the white color space here 
make sure it doesn't exit so that later when you put back the plastic, then it won't press the flower too much. And then, so, okay. So now we will start trying to do, so you can turn on your uh, hot glue, prepare your hot glue already. Hot glue. Yeah, I need to turn on my hot glue too. Let it heat up. Okay, everyone good? Okay, all good. Shall we move to the next step? Good. Give me a good if you are good. <laughs> all right, Ayn, what about you? Are you ready? Yep, okay. All right. So, okay. let us move to the next step. All right. So, while uh, waiting for the hot glue to heat up, uh, we can... Uh, you just take the long, uh, the longest thing. It may not be baby breath depending on your pack. And then you eye it and see what's the highest, highest height that you want it to be. You want it uh, not too high up, la, like maybe like this. If uh, the stem is longer, then you can trim it shorter or you can just uh, snip it with your finger. We decide on the highest and low, lower point first. You can start here. You can, it doesn't have to be here. Depends on you, whether you want it on the left and or the right. You can examine the flower. Like let's say this one, it's like bending to the left hand side, my left hand side. So I think this thing, Stay on the right side of my frame looks nicer instead of here. So I will stick it here later. So uh, if your hot glue is ready, so you can... Uh, is the hot glue ready? Is the run hot glue like hot enough? You can try to squeeze a bit. Like if things come out from the front can be squeezed already means it's ready. And then I'll demonstrate a bit how to use the hot glue in the safe way. So when you push a bit, you just need one little bit, one tap bit like this. Yeah, like this a little bit only. And then stick a bit. Not, uh, that means yours not ready yet. Yeah, if, if it's very hard to press, means the hot glue is not ready yet. So you just need to wait a little bit longer. So I stick one first. Oh, just stick on the uh, end of the flowers, right? Yeah, at the end of the frame. Make sure your hot glue doesn't touch this brown color. Either. stick up here it may not be very stable la, but it's okay later on when we add more flowers they'll be more stable okay is everyone's hot glue ready yeah 
Allah Amin Sama Emil Amin So uh, do I uh, put the glue here at the end? Yep, you do the glue at the very end of the tips Just squeeze a little bit Yeah, like this, squeeze a little bit and then you just go over the tips The tip And then when you want to finish Because it will pull a long strand then you just need to roll it up a bit Like this to cut off the strip and then stick it on the frame yeah and then remember put back your hot glue onto the paper or plastic bag because uh, it will take the glue will okay. drip okay so, if it doesn't stick, then you just need to try a few more times. Maybe it dry up already. Okay. So, mine looks a bit like this now. If it's like falling over, then you can put a bit on the side to cover and then to stick it to the side. To stable it. Yeah. So, now we'll move on to this, this comprina first. The so far, everyone okay? Okay. Okay, now we'll move on to this few little things first. This, we will stick them all at the bottom. But if you do get a very long stem gomprina, you can also use them as flowers tall like this so depending on your preference actually if let's say you have extra flowers at home i think they can use the flower and add on right yeah if let's say you just receive a bouquet from your boyfriend and you don't want to throw it because it's dry yeah. i think you can take it out and add it onto your frame at the side yeah hold on ah. need to stick back because mine keep falling okay so now we will move on to these gomprinas and then we will stick them at the corner they can be either facing up or facing the front like the front you just need to eye them first whether they exit the frame weight and then you can stick them in the corner facing out or a bit up depending on the size of the ball not ball yeah. depending on the size of the gomprina they can face the front if it's small they can face the front like this if not then you push them up as long as they don't exceed the frame white frame. the white frame area so the brown brown area is a reserve for your flower or your message right yeah so do we stick all the gonfrina now? Yep, stick the uh, gonfrina and then you can do it randomly. You don't need to use all that I gave you. You can just uh, arrange like maybe you put them there first and then see what kind of look and feel you like. Like you can imagine them as a garden, like one or two here and then a few here. And then I gave you pink and white one so you can like mix. Okay, here one three and here one four like that. For gomprinas, you can put the hot glue at their base like this and then stick it. If it's very hard to hold, then this is a time you can use the... Uh, What's that called? I forgot the name suddenly. The gap gap. You can use this. I think Sorry? you can call it tweezer. I think you can call it tweezer. tweezer. Yeah, yeah, tweezer, correct. Tweezer. Thank you so much. So, um, just to confirm. Hello? 
Yep, yep, yep. Can hear you. Just to confirm, um, uh, the for the flowers, I'm not sticking it at the background, right? But on the base or the white base here. Yep, the bottom. Yes, correct. Not sticking at the background, right? Yeah, you don't touch the brown color what because the white frame. The, the, the white the color. White, this white, white color. Is, yeah, white color is okay. But okay. the brown color, don't touch it. Okay. Got it. Yeah. And then when you stick at both sides, you can make sure one side is tall and then one side is a bit shorter so that they don't look like they are uh, level. So maybe like one, let, let's say this is my height. Okay, this is my highest. And then this one, I want it to be shorter here so that it has the, you know, that blah. The high and low like real gardens. Yeah. A real garden also can use a ruler to grow together. Yeah, something so they like have that. different heights. If the tall things like this keep falling, right, you can just leave it later and then after you finish the front part only you stick. So and then after the gomprinas, we are done with the gomprinas, and then we can proceed with this that this. Okay, and then the beauty with this statis, because some I may give you in bunch like this, and then some I give you uh, like maybe flakes, 